Hello and welcome to the first episode of Eon's Answers, where I try miserably to answer some of your science questions. As Einstein once said, knowing is half the battle. At least I think it was Einstein. Fire is the rapid oxidation of any substance, uh, combined with the release of a lot of energy as generally heat, light, sound. Uh, any quick reaction with oxygen, in other words. Uh, the flame itself is generally a, a hot gas that glows with black body radiation, as hot things do. Uh, if it becomes really hot, it can turn into a plasma, and then weird shit happens. Uh, it, it generally flickers because of convection currents and gravity. That was horrible. I keep looking down on my notes. It's not really helping. I should really pin that kind of there. As it turns out, magnetism is a relativistic byproduct of electricity. Electroism? Electricism? Moving electric charges. Start from, a, start from an equation like this, and you can derive all of electromagnetism uh, from a fully relevi relativistic standpoint. Kind of, kind of cool, really. As for magnets themselves, obviously. The law of energy conservation states that no energy can be lost or gained in a closed system. However, when two particles collide at high velocities and form a new larger particle, some of the form a new larger particle, the larger particle actually weighs less than the combined sum of the two smaller particles. Where has this mass gone? Well, it turns out that it's gone into energy, heat, light, other, and that's what E equals mc squared is saying, that energy and matter are the same, related by a conversion factor. So in theory, if you have enough energy, you can create something from nothing, like in the early ages of the of the universe. I need to stop saying um so much. Well, east and west are just our perceptions of space, so you could just call the North Pole east and the South Pole west. Doesn't really matter. We don't have an east and west magnetic pole as well as a north and south pole because of the way that the magnetic fields are formed in the Earth's core. Electric currents in the um, <laughs> in the liquid iron outer core cause a magnetic field to arise and this magnetic field acts as if the electric currents were a dipole, uh, meaning it only has two ends. Uh, so that's why we don't have four poles. Strip that white. Not very, you can buy it on iTunes. Thanks everyone for your for your questions. Uh, if you have any other questions, post them in the comments below. Um, also if you have any suggestions or feedback, I'd be happy to know them. Um, a new title for the show. Post them in the comments below. I'll read them, take them into account. It'll all be great. See you next time. She's a pale supernova with a bona fide attitude. Box set go, she's a sweat, nothing more to get a reach her altitude.